Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to do a 2016 kind of weight loss and fitness update or tips. Um, actually, I don't know what this video is going to be called, but it's going to be based on my 2016 goals for like weight loss and fitness and also kind of to give you guys motivation and tips for how you guys can get started with your weight loss journey because you know it's in January everyone has new year's resolutions a lot of them will probably be to lose weight um because that was one of mine for like the past how many years of my life and it never worked out for me or I just never took action with it but um so yeah I'm just going to kind of talk you guys through what I want to achieve this year and kind of help you guys to set yourselves on like a good start for 2016 in terms of your health and your weight loss and your fitness journey so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video um if you have any requests or anything do let me know in the comment section below and thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and if you want more kind of weight loss and health type of videos do let me know um and yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i'll talk to you in my next one bye guys oh okay so guys currently i'm 10 stone and 13 pounds um i kind of started my weight loss my weight lost like really i've kind of started my weight loss fitness journey again um at the start of january on january the 4th with one of my friends and we're both kind of doing this together so um i'm doing a whole month of cardio right now just to kind of get myself back into the swing of things and kind of detoxify my body type of thing i'm not too sure what my mentality behind this is but i'm just set on doing like a cardio month for a whole month before i jump straight into my weights and my strength training which is what i want to focus on for the year 2016 so um yeah especially because i feel like i indulge so much over the christmas holidays and you know i kind of want to get to the weight i was back before i went on holiday which was 10 stone and seven pounds so i've got about six pounds to lose before um end of january and today's date is the 17th of january so i've got about 13 days or 14 days two weeks to do it and hopefully i can but hopefully as long as i can get close to it as possible the rest can come off later so yeah for, so for this year i'm just trying to lose about five pounds five to ten pounds i would say because we can always lose weight i'm actually do you know what i don't want to say i want to lose weight because i know it's not good to go by your scales like you can look different and be the same weight or you can look way more and look completely completely like a like you could just look different even if you weigh the same weight or if you're way heavier so i'm just trying to work on how i look and try to get to the best i can be and be more confident in how i look type of thing and then i also want to get rid of my belly fat like guys my belly is not flat like it's not flat <laughs> if you see any pictures of me where my belly looks flat i'm more than likely just sucking in and holding my tummy which is what we all do so unless you got abs then what's that word unless you got abs then two it's not two doors what's that word kudos i don't know what that was but if you got abs great for you like not in a, in a, in a sarcastic way i mean honestly great for you but i just want like to get to the point where i don't have to suck in my belly like i want to get rid of my belly fat um i want to work on my lowering my fat body percentage which i still need to measure and i might go this week or by the end of the month i'm going to try and measure my body fat percentage and try and work on getting that reduced so i think that's what, what my goal is going to be for 2015 rather 2016 sorry rather than trying to get to a certain goal weight um so i'm going to work on my body fat percentage and then after january when i'm done with my cardio month i am going to work on my strength training i don't know like i just want to be strong like like this is like what is this guys i'm tense in this like this is nothing like what the hell is this like like this is like look at this look at this look at this so yeah i'm gonna try and work on my strength training um and building some strength and some muscles in the gym like strength training does work to you know reduce your body fat which is what i want to do so i'm gonna try a hand at that from february and i'll let you guys know my results as i go along um if you guys want that oh my god oh my god wow guys sorry guys like 
I'm trying to do two things at once. I'm trying to record a video and watch football at once. And these people are giving me high blood pressure. Like, for real, for real, for real. Okay, so I would say my goals for 2016 would be one, to improve my fitness and my, um, to improve my fitness and to improve my, um, overall health and my eating. To just kind of live a healthy lifestyle, which I've been, like, I think for me, the eating part is not hard because I can eat salmon and broccoli all day long. Like, literally, my favourite thing. Because, yeah, like, I can eat salmon and broccoli all day long. For me, it will probably be to be consistent um, with my exercising. Like, literally, this week just gone, I didn't go to the gym once. Not once did I go to the gym. And that was out of pure laziness. So, I think for me, for one, will be be consistent with my gym and try to go at least... Be consistent with my gym workouts and try to go at least three times a week anything actually will be a bonus for me um and you know number two will be to work on my strength training and increase my strength in the gym and you know my strength overall and try and build some muscles try and build some booty that's actually a goal for me guys like i need to build some boot some boot like my ugh. actually you know what? goal three is to build a booty or try and have something peachy back there like it's it's hard it's hard out here but yeah i'm gonna try and do that that will be number three number four will be for me to um reduce my body fat percentage and you know work on that i guess through my workouts which would be mainly strength training and also i will i will do i will do a couple of de cardio days as well there because i can't give up my cardio for nobody like i love to run on the treadmill so i would give up my cut i would still be doing my cardio but the majority of my workouts now would be more on strength will be more strength training than cardio as opposed to last year where i did more cardio to get rid of my weight so yeah and number five for my fitness goals or for 2016 will be just to be confident in how i look and be comfortable in how i look as well like yeah just be comfortable in my own skin and become comfortable in my body and how i look type of thing um and i kind of admit that my self-confidence has increased but it's still not all the way up there where it kind of should be or where i want it to be so i think that's another thing for me to work on and obviously as long as i'm working out as long as i'm taking care of my body hopefully it will increase and you know yeah basically it's just a process and i'll get there eventually i guess but yeah those will be my goals for 2016 so yeah i hope you guys enjoy this video um if you guys want more fitness or health those type of videos do let me know in the comment section below and i'll get those done for you but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video and you know I wish you guys luck on your weight loss, fitness journey, whatever goals you're trying to achieve for 2016. I hope you achieve them or surpass them or achieve more than them. Kind of like just just achieve more. And I just, you know, hope this video encourages people. And, you know, it's hard to lose weight. Like I've been there before and you're just feeling down and you just don't like how you look. But honestly, guys, I reckon like you can do it you can do it as long as you're consistent as long as you go you know you don't give up and as long as you've got a good support network around you, you you can do it like you can do it like along the way i had my my friends supporting me and my family supporting me and i think that's all that matters as long as you have people around you to support you and if you believe in yourself as well that you can do it you can do it and you know set goals for yourself don't set unrealistic goals because then you're just gonna get upset when you don't get there so set yourself reasonable goals try to stick them try try to stick to them as much as possible and just be consistent and be patient and you will get there so yeah so thank you guys so much for watching and if you have any more questions regarding weight loss you can leave them in the comment section below or you can send me an email my email will be in in the description box for you guys so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll talk to you in my next one. Bye guys. Mwah.